Hello and welcome back to another solo salvage survival series where today we have a few things to do. First things first, I need to strip all of this ship down and all of this ship down. That's going to take me a minute, but luckily for you guys, I get to do that off camera and you don't have to see it. And then I think we have to do a little bit of work on the base. Uh, nothing too flash or major. I'm thinking maybe running a conveyor system, um, mostly from these cargo containers to out here. That way we can make like a little docking area for our ship there. And then I want to go shoot something again. I don't know what it'll be. I want to go shoot something though. I know that. Do I have oxygen? I have a little bit of oxygen, don't I? Yes, okay. I'm gonna go get this thing. I want to go shoot something. I don't know what yet. We'll figure it out. I'm thinking one of the assert things because they like to put up a fight because um, they're our enemy already. Yeah, I'm not sure. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. And so I know I left last episode off wondering about the, the shields. Whether or not I should put the shield mod on. And I'm thinking for now. I'm not going to. Um, oh yay, money. Um, I'm not going to for now. I think uh, we're just going to have to man up. We're going to have to put um, a bunch of heavy armor on our ship. And we should be fine with that. That's kind of the way the vanilla game is heading. Is with more expanse style. Less Star Trek style. And I'm, I'm thinking we're going to follow the game's lead on this one. So, no shields. No shields whatsoever. Just, we've got to replace everything on that ship with heavy armor as we get the bits and bobs for it. I'm not going to do it just as of yet. I might actually... No, no, not yet. No, I was going to say I'll replace all these ones. We won't, we won't do these yet. We'll replace them as they get broken. Um, which probably will happen sooner rather than later. Is something on fire over there? Oh, that's the ore detector in it. Yeah, can you not be on fire? Is that... Thanks. Yeah, I know you're broken. I don't really need you right now. I just don't want you on fire. That's all. all right, so we got the thrusters on there. Oh, that's right. This has that modded thrusters on here too, doesn't it? The assert thrusters, which are just slightly better in almost every way. Um, we got to incorporate them. Where'd it go? How do I lose it every time? We got to incorporate them into this ship because this ship does need a little bit more thrust power too. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to get to work getting rid of this and this one's hole i think we might i might put on the turrets gotta put another turret on the roof um oh uh, yeah should i do it i don't know what should i should i do it do you think it would be a good idea if i do it i know you guys don't know what i'm talking about but robert built these little um ai custom turret things in the multiplayer world and I was very impressed with how well they work. That is a very loud bird. I don't know why the cockatoos are out screaming at seven o'clock at night but hey you know what you do you home home birdie you do you. Yeah you made these custom little turrets and I'm thinking I want to put a couple on the ship. We might put one on the nose here. Yeah we'll put one here. I will that's heavy armor already in it. Yeah sweet so we might put one on the nose here and see how she goes too in the battle. But either way, I think it's time I get to work doing this. This is going to take a minute. Um, so, let's not waste any more time. Oh, wow. 
So while I'm minding my own business, a gunboat has decided to attack me, Robert. I'm just sitting here in uh. Discord with Robert and minding my own business and ooh, oh, oh, try to ram me. Who do you think you are? Who do you think you are? Huh? Think you can ram me? You can't ram me. Yeah. Sucker. <laughs> that was one that was wholly unexpected and now everything is floating everywhere. Um, yeah. <laughs> Goddamn pirates. Uh, you ruined me day. My nice, peaceful salvaging operation. But I guess I got a new ship. Um, has a couple of missiles on it. And now I have to go collect a bunch of parts that are floating away. What were we discussing? Oh, yeah. Things we have to do in our, in our world. Um, yeah, uh, stopping things, Robert, we should do that. <laughs> uh, where's my little gravity ship gone? Where is the gravity ship? That's not the gravity ship. You're not the gravity ship. Oh my god, where's the gravity ship? Robert, where's my gravity ship? Robert? You need some me? Well, you need to go find it. Man. There it is, found it. It's okay, I had it tucked away in a hidden, a hidden, a hidden spot. Alright, time to begin Operation Rescue Floating Bits. Oop, and crash into the uh, base, that's fine, we don't worry about that. So how much power have I got? Not much. Um, I knew I should have made that as a station. Uh, actually, those bits seem to be pretty steady. It's only the large chunk, which I don't think this ship's actually going to be able to stop the large chunk. Um, that'll be interesting to see actually try to happen. Uh, what do you think my success rate is going to be for stopping a large ship floating away with a tiny small grid ship with only two thrusters? As in with that large thing is. How much what's on it? Uh, stuff. Yeah, if it's a bunch of steel plates, mm -hmm. I have probably. If it's like a carbon container or some other type of heavy mass items. Mm -hmm. Uh, let's see, we are very slowly slowing down. It's okay, it's okay. Um, now that we've slowed down, can I actually dun do, dun do the opposite and pull it back to base? Can I give a little bit of thrust power, and then we can float back to base. Okay. <laughs> well, that was 100% unexpected, and thankfully my ship took care of business. Alright, back, back to the grindage. Well, it's been some time. Things have passed. I've packed everything away from the ship. It's also been a few days since I last recorded. I am also a bit tired at the moment, but we'll power on through and we'll make it to the end of this video before I fall asleep. Also, Robert's here. I'm in Discord with him and he wanted to try and hide, but I said he couldn't. Say hello, Robert. English. Hi, this is why I didn't want to join you. <laughs> yeah. I know that feeling. I couldn't English speak properly earlier either, too. See? Word English not hard easy. <laughs> we are definitely a pair. Yeah, we're something. Um what are you doing? I'm I'm I've just I, I had to scrap down a bunch of chips and I had to put the components in on my storage areas. I've got a new storage area over this side now. I also ground down a bunch of the NPC thrusters because I don't think I can actually use them. It, it, it said that these could only be used by NPC uh, factions, so I, I got rid of them. I did keep a couple. Or I did keep the um, special thrusters if I can actually find them. There you go. There's an assert thruster. That one. Yeah, that's another one. That's another one. Okay, so we got a few of the assert thrusters left lying about. Um, yeah, it's, it's, I'm pretty happy with that. Also, I think I lost the gravity generator. I think I got blown it up when I got attacked by that. Um, I got blown, yeah, when I got attacked by that drone thing that attacked us. You know, I think Robert was here for that too. I was in the Discord with him as well when that happened. That was a couple, yesterday or the day before or whatever that world that was. That was a while ago. Uh, anyway, 
Anyway, now what we need, what I want to do is I want to find a way, I want to not find a way, I know how I'm going to do it. I want to connect uh, all the, the, the ship up to the base, I want there to be like a docking section right here. Um, the only issue is the asteroid here kind of, you know, it's like on a, cur on a curve and I want the ship, I don't know, like I don't want it to stick out like a big sore thumb sticking out of the side of the asteroid, which means I know how I can do it. I just have to see if it's going to work as well as I think it's going to work. Essentially, it's going to end up boiling down because the connecting point is there. Right, I just gotta see what angle roughly I can get at. So I think it'll probably end up parking something like that, which means to connect this to the base, I'm gonna have to build the connection point on a hinge um, or a rotor. Hinge or a rotor? Uh, I think I'm gonna go hinge. I think hinge will work better. Um, yeah. Yeah, so we come out here roughly and then got like a connection point and everything should be all fine and hunky dory and the world should be all good. Alright, so let's get. I don't want to switch that signals to fully visible. Let's go G. I should probably turn them on a little bit though so I can see if something's coming. Uh, I'm going to need a conveyor junction. Okay, I'm going to need the hinge. Hingey boy, give me the whole hinge. And uh, we're going to need a connecto. There we go. Connecto. Alright. Let's see. Can I just dump whatever I have in my inventory? I don't even know what it is. Give me one of those. Give me one of those. And give me as many of those as you can fit. Alright. I want. Also, give me as many of those as I can carry. I kind of want it to come off there's gonna be like a corridor here we should have a two-way corridor yeah of course i'm gonna have a two-way corridor which is gonna make this not look um perfectly straight which is fine um that's not at all silly and i can easily change my plans to make it so everything will be all lined up nice and smoothly and it will all in shape and stuff, but no, I refuse. Because I am a refusing boy, and I refuse to bow down to the establishment and do as they expect. Or something like that, I don't know. I'm insane and tired, and it's all Robert's fault. So, I'm gonna go like that. I'll have, should I have, I should have like that. And then we'll go over junk that. Alright. Hey, large steel tubes. I thought I grabbed everything. Um, large steel tubes. Sure, give me nine. I'm sure that's enough. Uh, let that. And we build one of those. Okay. Now we just need to turn this, let's say, so if that's straight, is that straight? I'm kind of getting confused because the gravity is throwing me off from the ship. Um, Okay, we want to go 45 degrees, I think. 45 degree would be nice. I need a panel though. A panel to control things. And then we should be able to do... I don't care if you're upside down. You're not permanent. You're a temporary solution. Uh, hinge. I'm just going to put name you as Dock Connector. Just so I know what you are in the future. I can't imagine me using too many hinges. I say that. Alright, so velocity. Okay. Alright, well, we want you to have the upper limit of 45. Boom. That's. There we go. Uh, yeah, I think that will be alright. I don't want it to. I think that will actually kind of force me to. Yeah, that's fine. It'll make me kick the arse end of the ship out just a little bit. But I think, uh, hold on, no, because that means I can't even log dock on one way. If I move it, hmm, this is, this is why 
This is why we do tests, because now I'm not sure. Um, hinge. No, I don't want all the other nonsense. Hinge. Uh, let's go to like... 33? So if we do like a 33... Alright. Far out are we gonna go? This is... This isn't as simple as I thought this was gonna be. And it's all Robert's fault. Um... Let's You're go with... Me while I'm here. Uh, shushy, I didn't give you permission to speak. Um, I really dragged me in here. I had to deal with me. I didn't drag you in here. You were already in here. You dra you, 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 you're at fault, not me. And I have witnesses. How do you like them apples, huh? I flipped it on you. Alright, let's just go here. Hinge. Hinge. I just want to go... You can just... Be locked. Don't move. Don't ever, ever move. Alright, let's see if I can't connect. I just vented the ship to space. It's fine. I only do that regularly. It's not like I have a none. It's not like I don't have a limited supply of uh, ice or anything like that. Alright. Let's see. If we... Line everything up. Okay. Okay, so there we go. Um, oh, my hand. <laughs> Let's go here. We're gonna go switch the lock. Also, why does the ship look like it's drifting? Is it just um? It's not the button I wanted to press. Uh, is it just me being weird? Yeah, it's just me being weird. Okay, so number two. Bam! The ship is now officially docked with the station. You know what? I kind of think. Yeah, I think that works quite well like that. Can I dock from the other way? Alright, so let's just un... Nope, this way. Let's just move this ship. And as you can see, I did put the... I put two of the assert thrusters on the on the ship already in the one spot that we had easy access. Um, so yeah, that's interesting. Let's see how they work. Let's just move the ship around. Turn its fat nose, and as I was play uh, when I placed down those assert thrusters, I also kind of replaced the blocks that I had to cut off to fit it in there with heavy armor because, like I said, everything's got to change to heavy armor uh, slowly. I also decided against using shields for now. I think I mentioned that at the start of the episode. I don't know. I don't remember to be honest. Um, Okay, are we actually going to be able to dock? I think we might be okay. Um, it's just that arse in the bows. So that front window a little bit? I think that front block might have taken a bullet from that drone that attacked us or something because it's a bit damaged still. Right, let's just go down. Okay, we're too far forward. I should probably put mirror window, um, windows. Cameras on the side of this vessel to line up these connectors a bit better. Um, where are you? Can't tell. A bit more down. Okay. And that side we're locked on. I mean, it's a... Whew. We get in there, we're nice and tied up against the asteroid, but hey, it works. And that's the key thing, is that that works. Alright, let's go... where's the exit? That's not the exit. I am getting turned around on my own ship. And that's okay. That is okay. So we go out here, we can see... Yes, this is the right side. See the platform there. We come in here, open these. Cycle the airlock, and out we come! Onto... 
the station. Alright, so what I want to do is while I've got this ship here, I need some steel plates. Excuse me, I need to borrow your stuff. Thanks. Alright. What I want to do is, I don't want to place that block there. That block there is not what I want to do. Stop being rude. Alright, let's place that. Let's grab some of these. Alright. The idea in my brain is I want to kind of create like a little walk off platform right there. I think that'll work. Sort of. I mean, it's not perfect. Hey. It's actually not that bad. I think that would yeah, that works pretty well. I mean, you gotta mind the gap like you're boarding a train, but hey, it works. It works, Robert. Are you proud of me? I am proud of you. That didn't sound like you're proud of me. I don't think he's proud of me, guys. I don't think it's Robert approved, and that's what I live for. I live for Robert approval because I don't get any from my family and I need it from strangers on the internet and he's not giving it to me and he hurt my feelings I think we should I think we should hashtag cancel Robert hashtag cancel I think hashtags are cringe um I think anything to do with uh, social media and stuff is generally pretty cringe by definition Just the way that things seem to be. Okay, let's go down here. It really annoys me that I lost that gravity generator. Alright, well, we're gonna have this. Okay, how do I. That rock has to go. It's sticking up, it's gonna annoy the hell out of me. Alright. Um. Hey, uh, oh, I'm using the wrong one. Okay, I put that like that. Okay, like this. Yeah, I do want the entire asteroid base to be airtight. Um, now the way I'm going to do that is just by making it in sections, basically. Well, not in sections, like like having like little pods of corridors that are airtight all the way through them. Um, I feel like that's probably the best way for me to do things. And let's just go like that. Okay, perfect. There we go. And now we get this nice little pathway here that I'll fill in like so. Alright, we got this nice little corridor leading to outside. Uh, we'll have to build a double airlock system. Um, like that. What's this? I'm just going to use, not conveyor, just, yeah, conveyor tubes. I thought it said curve, I was going to. My brain just gets those confused. Alright, so I'll have that. And then along here, because there'll be doors here, I'm thinking I want to use... There's the... There's that. That's not the one I'm looking for. It's a, it's a decorative blocks, I think. Maybe decorative blocks too. Where is the new interior things? Is it under pit columns or something? They put things under weird things. Yeah, it's under column. For some reason, the new interior walls and stuff are under columns. Now we got these, like these curved ones here. Um, I think I want to use them. And I want to use them. Oh. Do I want to use them here? Oh, that's going to be. I was thinking of doing that, like having a row of them. Because I was going to put them there, but that's just, it's too big. It needs to be a minimum three wide corridor. Um, and we haven't got a three wide corridor. We've got a two wide corridor. I could make it three wide. I just don't think I want to. <laughs> okay, so we can do that there. Or we can use the... I don't even know where they are. Uh, where's the other interior walls? Let's just send it interior. No, a wall. Okay. Uh, these guys, where are these guys? Passageway walls. It's under passage. Passage. Okay, we can try. I kind of want these industrially looking ones. Because that's the match of the ship. The ship's using the same ones. So if we use that. Okay, the only downside is. The light one, it's going to be difficult with lights. Because 
There is no light one. <laughs> uh, my plans are flying apart before me, Robert. Plan better. I know I've got to plan better. It's all your fault. Okay, what I could do. I keep blaming Robert and I like it. Um, what I can do is we might we might just bite the bullet. And we might just fall down here. And I might just expand the corridor. One extra block. All that all that stone has to go. Uh, it's in the way, and I don't like it. So now we have a three wide corridor, and if I just temporarily grab these blocks, alright, like so, then we can go back to my original plan, and if I can find the right block, there we go. We can do that. Do that. Then we do this. And then up the top here. Oh, well, that's right, we're gonna have the convey junction. <sighs> it's fine. It's fine. That's actually not as bad as it seems. I can actually work with this. Alright, so let's just we'll get rid of that. We'll float away for a bit because the gravity plate mag boots can't disconnect with themselves. What we can, can do is I can not do anything because I don't have the conveyor junctions anymore on my hotbar. It's alright, it's not like I need those still. Um, I want to use these ones. Where are you? There you are. See, this is the problem, Robert. It's all Robert's fault. Robert is always just... Is it, is it like... I don't know. Robert, what are you like? That just seems arrogant. Mysterious. Who do you think you are? Some sort of god? No, I am. I am god. I am god of all. No, no, no. I'm no god. I know that you're no god. I don't want to be known. Alright, let's do that. We do have this one. Worthy of background character. <laughs> you think you're worthy of background character status? Yeah, I think so. Fair enough. I like the confidence. Alright, yeah. let's uh, put this in here like so. And this like so. Then we're going to have like some weird like gap where these two aren't connected. Maybe I'll put a random block there and not weld it up. And then that will be our entrance way. I think that'll look alright. Alright, I think I should probably weld all this stuff up. What do you reckon, Robert? Do you reckon I should just weld all this stuff up so we can have a good look at it? And I have no idea what he said. I'm weld, just going to do what I want to do. Weld it up. Yeah. Ah, weld it up. There you go. He made a half-assed decision. <laughs> See you. Skip. After an amount of time that I care to not admit to, and nobody shall ever ask me as per the Star Citizen code, I have finished the corridor, energy, and my suit energy is low, and my water is low. of course it is. But we got this nice little welded up panel, we can walk off nice and neatly here, I think I've already shown that. Um, if I can just quickly come up here, and steal some water from somewhere, interstellar beer, sure let's crack open a beer. Um, it's gonna give me some sleepiness, that uh, tracks, alright let's just... B doesn't give you that much thirst filler. I mean, it's nice on a hot day. Anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. Here is my corridor. Uh, that's a hinge. But here is my corridor. As you saw, this section is pressurized. I haven't set up the pressurized and depressurization script and things as of yet. I will. Um, but for now, it's just basic stuff. We got that here. Then we open up to a nice long corridor which is also oxygenated as you can see I've got high oxygen and warmth it's nice it's cozy it's cool and everything is working now even got another little section I did expand a little bit down here all right we got like a nice little air armory uh, a little interface block so I can build stuff I put this workstation down here because you can actually stand on it 
and like recharge. Uh, I'm not doing it right now, but before I was like typing on it or something. That's cool. It's great. It's just a nice little recharge station for me. Oh, there he goes. See, he pushes random buttons and stuff every now and then. But uh, yeah, that's good. It saved me having to run all the way back up to the ship and using the slower survival kit. That charges you up just as quickly as the survival kit. Wait, I actually don't know how fast that charges you. I wasn't paying attention. Um, but yeah, then we got this little room here, little armory, a little locker, and we got windows overlooking the um, the rest of the station at the moment. I'm I, I'm looking forward to having all of this built up so I can walk around it properly. But for now, this is what it looks like. Don't look up here. No, you're not allowed to look. I said no. I said no. You can't look up here. I, it's not ready to be looked at. All right. It still hasn't been beautified. But yeah. This is everything we've got going so far. I'm quite happy with it. I think it's looking pretty damn good. Um, and I'm also exhausted and tired. And I think I'm going to call this episode here. If you did like this episode, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I think next episode I'm going to go shoot some stuff again. Um, I'm going to have to build one of Robert's little turrets on the ship that we have. Uh, and I want to see how that works in space. I'm still deciding where I want to put, every time I open that I'm going to lose oxygen, but you know what, it is what it is, nothing I can do about it. But I can, there is something I can do about it, I just choose not to do anything about it. Um, I think what I'm going to do, is I might try, uh, I was going to place them there, no, I think, I think I'm going to stick with the, placing it here. Yeah, I think it's going to be here. It's going to be sticking up a little bit. It might look a little bit funny. We might look like we have a wart on our nose of our ship or something. I don't know. But those turrets are fun. I mean, they just, they sound awesome. That's pretty much all I'm interested in. Also, I don't really know how I'm going to cover this up. Um, maybe we can do, just like, that's not panel. This is panel. Alright, maybe we can just put like, panel on here and... Uh, where is the... <sighs> There's too many in this list. This one. Something like that, maybe? I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know how I'm going to cover that up. Uh, like, it doesn't really bother me that much, to be honest with you. I do like having this here. I just think it kind of looks neat. And, um... I'm not going to change it, because... <laughs> I like how the ship winds up here. You can't win everything. You can't win everything. Maybe when I'm less sleepy, I'll be able to figure out how to organize all that. But like I said, that's it for now, guys. If hope you enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And as always, have a good one. And I'll see you all next time. Bye. Say bye, Robert. Robert's not even paying attention. He's so rude. He might even not be there. He might be AFK. I don't know. Whatever. I gotta go. Sleepy time.